Hello everyone, this is Afra from Quick WordPress Websites. Today we are going to see how to reset your WordPress sites. That means how to delete the contents of this WordPress site and make it as a default site. For that you have to go to your WordPress dashboard. So I am going to the, my dashboard and go to plugins and click add new. Search for plugin called WP Reset. Once you click enter, you will see the first item WP Reset, most advanced reset tool for WordPress. It's by Web Factory Limited. So install this plugin and activate it. So once you activate it, it will automatically show. Thank you for installing WP Reset plugin and open tools WP Reset. So you can open here. Or else you had to go to the dashboard, click tools and you had to find the so here WP Reset. So both method will work. So before going to the reset, better to take the backup. So please read the description how to take backup of your site. So in WP Reset also there is a simple backup option available but it is not uh, always working. Here you can see the uh, backup is called snapshots. So it will take the last snapshot of your website. So you can create a snapshot, put a name. So I am putting a name as my shop and create snapshot. So this will take a simple backup but not fully. So don't trust on this backup because it's not always working. So better to take backup for that. Please read the description how to take backup. So just we have taken a snapshot. Let's go back to the reset and go down. And here you have to type reset to reset your WordPress site. So before type into reset, there are three options. So site reset, recut, uh, reactivate current team. So my current team is Astra. So if you want to delete all the contents and you want to reactivate the current team, you can just select this or else just leave it. Reactivate WP reset plugin because once you reset your website, all the plugin will be disabled. So if you want to keep the reset plugin, you can reactivate it. So better keep it open. And other things reactivate all currently active plugins. So if you don't need the plugins, just leave it. So let's type reset and click reset. It will again confirm. Are you sure you want to reset the site? Yes. Click reset WordPress. So now the website is reset. So let's see how the website have been reset. And you can see now the website is reset to the default one. And also if you want to go to the plugins and you can see the install plugins. So all the install plugins have been deactivated. So if you want to keep all the plugins, you can reactivate them. Or if you don't want, if you want to delete all them, just select all. And you can select delete and click apply. But before going to apply that, better leave this reset icon reset plugin because if you want to get the snapshot back you have to keep this uh, wp reset so let's see how to take back the snapshot so again go to the wp reset tools go to snapshots click actions click restore snapshot yes restore snapshot Okay, now the snapshot has been restored. So let's see how the website is looks right now. Hurrah, now the website is, is restored. But keep in mind, the snapshot option is not fully work in all the complex websites. So better to take backup if you want to reset the WordPress sites. Thank you very much. If you want further videos, please leave us a comment and please subscribe our channel.